Dear ladies and gentlemen, first of all, I regret not being able to be with you today, but I didn't want to miss the opportunity to express my support to the work that you are doing in this extremely important area of our cooperation. For nearly 10 years now, cross-border cooperation has played a key role in strengthening the economies of border regions, in protecting the environment, and more generally in bringing people together. At a time when borders are being portrayed as a line separating countries and people, it's particularly important to acknowledge the cross-border initiatives led by men and women who have decided to share ideas and values and to join efforts for improving their daily life together. The impact achieved is considerable and makes a real difference for citizens living and working in these regions. The strength of these programs lies in the fact that both member states and partner countries participate on fully equal terms, pursuing their respective priorities and interests, which very frequently they share in common. This has fostered a high level of enthusiasm, ownership and commitment. The MED program is the largest segment in terms of geographical coverage and budget, with a total of 13 participating countries, seven European Union member states and six Mediterranean partner countries. This includes 98 territories covering 190 million people. The first generation of this program was worth 200 million euros and founded 95 projects involving over 730 Mediterranean organizations, mainly local and regional authorities, as well as civil society organizations. We targeted various sectors, including the creation of startups, enhancement of economic clusters, energy efficiency, better use of water resources, empowerment and inclusion of disadvantaged women, and waste management. The results have been very encouraging, so we aim to increase funding for the second generation of this program. In view of the political and economic turmoil of the last years in the southern neighborhood, I'm convinced that the cross-border cooperation is one of the most powerful tools we have to contribute to the stabilization of regions. This was, after all, the founding idea of the European Union. By strengthening economic ties across political borders, we reduce the possibility of conflict and get closer to our ultimate objective, the creation of a space where peace, democracy and prosperity can thrive.